Hello, this is not a spring chicken. If it looks like we're cooking, it might be because we are. Yeah, I know. Well, you gotta eat sometimes, right? Okay, so major news today. Oh, it's Monday, but we've got some things coming to you. And oh, yeah, we're gonna bring old Kim on with comments on the headlines of today. President Obama's gamble on immigration front. Well, first of all, he has those voters. And not, I keep pointing out the fact that no one is going to register for a short-term work visa knowing that Obama basically just put the door, closed the door on any immigration reform period for the next couple of years. And the work visa runs out. So, you know, if the Democrats had two years, they controlled the House and Senate presidency. They did not do immigration reform. What makes you think they will do it now since the President of the United States basically told all the people they need to elect them. Screw all of you people. I only care about the liberals on the left. You know, we don't, they said, I heard a list talking this morning. They said, the President of the United States has now forsaken anyone but the left of his party. Totally forsaken anyone but the left. And you can't win an election with 27% of the people. It can't be done. No. And unions threaten to bring this country to its knees unless their demands are met. I know. Isn't that amazing? They're down to like 11% of the population and threatening to shut. Well, it's basically the, pro the public sector workers led by SEIU and others are going to teach this nation that we decide what goes on in this country. You can't live without us. Well, yeah. Basically, you fire their rear ends and hire all the illegal aliens that are in here that can't get jobs. <laughs> And SEC concerned about Facebook's ad revenue before IPO. Yeah. They, well, they were. They, everybody knew there was no, okay, it is not, that's why they're trying to build their own cell phone, is because they need to have something that is totally designed for Facebook and none of this other stuff. It is not, does not do mobile well because it removes all the ads on the mobile. An Indonesian man gets 30 month sentence for Facebook comments. Are you serious? Oh yeah, uh, only in the United States can you make comments on Facebook without violating some law. You'd be thrown in jail in, in, in Canada or Great Britain for what you say on Facebook or Twitter. Wow, and Miss US, because you know, they can't consider it slander. That's right, they right? also have, well they have hate crime laws there where, where basically, if you say that the President of the United States is a bad person, they can basically toss you in jail for calling it a hate crime because He's, he's an Afro-American. And John McCain's war on senseless additions to the farm bill. Well, yeah, because they're putting everything, they're packing the farm bill with so much pork, it's unbelievable. And cancer survivors will increase by millions, report says. Not likely. Under Obamacare, you won't have as many survivors because under Obamacare, it restricts care to only those people that it's going to most help, which you, I can't understand. The a-holes that are supported are the people that are not going to have it anymore. They don't seem to get it. That in, in all the other countries, they ration health care, and the people, the old ones, don't get it. That's how it works. And man reportedly contracts plague trying to save mouse. I know. I, 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 no one understands. But he's, he's trying to save it from his cat. So. Oh, um, really? Yeah. <laughs> that was sort of ridiculous. But the way he got bit. He got bit by the mouse. He yeah, play. and he got scratched by the cat too. So, <laughs> you you don't take a mouse away from a cat. The same. You, would you take a bone away from Monty when she was eating? <laughs> no. You know there are some things that mm, you didn't know do that. Um, sex scandals, a different story in Europe. They don't give a rat's ass in Europe. I mean, they basically they would consider Edwards. You know, that he had bad taste in whoever he was jumping, but then they would also say, you know, Viva la Edwards, because mm -hmm. this is what they do in Europe. They all have sex candles. And Wall Street week ahead, Spain and, and Dill calms Europe's fears. Well, yeah, basically, uh, the bailouts are not working well at all. They see they, they, they haven't got a government agreed to in, in Greece because they said the only way they're going to agree to it is that they're going to have to change the terms of the agreement that was made by the same people they just elected. The people that were elected said that they will cancel the loans and renegotiate and Merkel said that's not going to happen so guess what happened? They can't form the government that they, they need to form. they got a day and a half left to form a new government. It ain't going to happen at the moment. And United Health could keep reform provisions regardless of court ruling.
No. If they rule against it, it's going to go tomorrow. I mean, if the, within 10 minutes, if the Supreme Court kills Obamacare, it is gone. That's because there's nothing to be afraid of of him anymore, except he will try it by, uh, uh, he will do a, okay, what people understand is, is that an executive order only affects people that do business with the government, and the majority of the people in this nation do not do business with the government. They do not take money from the government, they do not sell anything to the government, so therefore, he will executive order his health care into those people that do business with the government, and um, they'll just simply not do business with the government as long as Obama's president. And inside, Google goes softly, softly on European antitrust. Yeah, because Google is basic. Google is, is the early version. Okay, Microsoft is in, uh, Yahoo was first, Google, I mean, then um, then came Microsoft with Bing, and then Google. They, each, they're, they're basically like the Roman Empire. They're in decline. From the day you first start business, you start in decline. And militants infiltrate Israel from Egypt, too reported dead. Yeah, this is what you can look forward to if the uh, Arab Brotherhood c takes over Egypt, which isn't likely to happen because the, the trick is the, the, laws that is, uh, is, the laws of Egypt prevent the Muslim Brotherhood from holding office, so how can you have a president if... Okay, they just threw out all the parliament because it was a Muslim Brotherhood. They don't allow fundamental Muslims to hold office in Egypt. And winds and high temperatures fan Colorado wildfires. Oh God, they, yeah, basically, um, well, here we got nothing. I mean, we have, basically, we might have wind, but it's just, bleh, so. Mm -hmm. And Greek and pro-bailout parties seek a new coalition. Not going to happen. They said that, that the same reason they couldn't form a coalition in the last government is the same reason they can't form one in this one. Mm -hmm. And Bain or Romney can put economy back together. Yeah, basically what you do is you let everything fail. You let the things fail. When they fail, then you declare bankruptcy and start over again. This is what's happening. Bankruptcy basically allows people to reorganize. Under Obama, no one has been able to reorganize. And former media chief Blair thought Brown was bonkers. Yeah, because, um, they, okay, the last guy basically... He was elected because he wasn't Tony Blair, which is why you have Obama in this country. They find when you elect someone because they're not the other person, you generally get a devil you don't want. Mm -hmm. And G20 to confirm IMF loan pledge despite reform delay. Well, they said there's not going to be, they're going to reform it, but nobody's going to put any money for it. Except, guess what nation is going to say we're going to contribute? Who? The United States. Of course! Because Obama, this, you know his advice? Print all the money you need. Because I mean, the man has no brains. I mean, uh, okay, well, they do that the money is not worth anything. You can print, you know, like they said, America, America is trying to grow its business by creating printing presses that other countries can use to print money that's worthless. And global shares in euro jump as EU aids Spanish banks. No, they just tanked this afternoon. They did. America, they're down tremendously because. Uh, Spain's interest, the cost to borrow money to fix Spain has went through the roof. It's, it's basically like three times higher than they thought it would be. So they're selling the bonds. The bonds are working. They said Spain can never pay the interest back on the, on the bonds they're getting, which means it was a disaster. And Japan calls for tougher insider trading rules. But that won't happen either because Japan, I mean, those countries are not ran like our idea. Our inside of, our, I, they're all insiders in those countries. They, that's what the hell they make their money. And women's basketball coach faces harassment suit. Well, yeah, basically, yeah. Uh, you, you don't be a coach of a woman's sport because you're screwed in this country. They, they'll charge you with harassment if they. If what they about? I know, it's kind of screwy, huh? Well, no, basically you do not want to be a woman's coach under any circumstances because you can't win. Men win, men win. If women are the coaches, you can't win. If men are the coaches, you can't win. So it basically it's under a self-destructing mechanism because of litigation. And missing link found in cyber weapon hunt. I know, uh, I know. This Basically, uh, it's our cyber weapon stuff that Obama blew the whistle on. Well, oh, it is. doesn't believe in the military, folks. And Secret Files put Steve Jobs in new light. Yeah, the guy was a real thug, so like anybody that didn't know Steve Jobs didn't know that he wasn't a really not nice person. And a Monty bubbleism from the Mark Twain of the Animal Kingdom. Okay, in this modern world of, uh, of electronic media, when it's over, it's really over.